nastavljamo sa predavanjem pod nazivom Specifična situacijska kondicijska priprema u natjecateljskom mikrociklusu. Predavač je profesor doktor, gospodin Aksinte Aleksandru, EHF lektor. Igračku karijeru ostvario je u klubu Relov Relonu u Savinijesti i rumunjski je reprezentativac od 1988. do 1992. Kao trener bio je angažiran kao pomoćni trener u prvoligaškim klubovima. Od 1966. trener je za fizičku pripremu rumunjske juniorske reprezentacije. Inače je doktor znanosti, redoviti profesor na Fakultetu za zdravlje, sport i kineziologiju, sveučilišta Vasil Aleskandri u Bakau, član je Upravnog odbora Fakulteta za tjelesni odgoj, član je Senata sveučilišta u Bakau, voditelj je ocijeka za timske igre Fakulteta za tjelesni odgoj sveučilišta u Bakau, međunarodni je ekspert, procijenitelj znanstvenih projekata podnesenih Rumunjskom nacionalnom zdravstvenom fondu pri Ministarstvu obrazovanja i znanosti, a istu ulogu obnaša i za Bugarsko ministarstvo. Član je znanstvenog savjeta časopisa Area de Balonmano, koji objavljuje Španjolski rukometni savez. Kao predavač ili predavač EHF-a sudjelovao je u brojnim kongresima, projektima, trenerskim seminarima i seminarima za master trenere u Španjolskoj, Srbiji, Moldaviji, Austriji, Sloveniji, Bugarskoj, Kosovu, Norveškoj, Mađarskoj, Švedskoj, Češkoj, Portugalu, Bjelorusiji, Gruziji, Poljskoj, Malti, Estoniji i Makedoniji. Voditelj je Tehničke komisije Rumunjskog rukometnog saveza i dopredsjednik Metodičke komisije Rumunjskog rukometnog saveza. Izvolite, gospodine Aleksandar. Ok. Ok. Dobri dani, kolege i prijatelji. Čekaj. First of all, I would like to thank you all for the opportunity to be here and to share some of my experience. It's a great honor, really, to act uh, with these guys, to be in the middle of this uh, gorgeous stuff, and we will see at the end of our lesson if we will deserve some applause, or doesn't matter what. First of all, I, uh, I'd like to... Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Zahvaljujem vam se na prilici da dođem ovamo i da s vama i pred vama i pokažem neka svoja iskustva u trenerskom znanju, da radim s ovim prekrasnim momcima i da budem dio ovog izvrsne ekipe z 41. seminara. Uh, ako budemo zavrijedili kakav aplauz, dobrodošao je. Ok, now I kindly ask you to give me the opportunity to have some words with uh, these guys. Dopustite mi samo da se malo dogovorim s našim igračima. Circle. Circle. Okay, then uh, I think you are a very good English speaker, first of all, right? Then we will have a lot of fun. Okay. Uh, as you heard, my name is Aleksandr Aksinte, you can call me Alex. Okay. Nećemo raditi puno s loptom, nego ćemo puno skakati. Dobro bi bilo da pogledate ovu našu teoričku prezentaciju na početku, jer ćete te neke stvari raditi kasnije. Sada ću vam 
We will uh, start with a short presentation uh, from the theoretical point of view of the, of the topic we presented in practical approaching. Počinjemo sa kratkom prezentacijom teorijskih postava kao o temi koju ćemo za nas prezentirati. Guys, you can come here. Dečki, uh, možete se doći i pogledati prezentaciju. You can sit, make some stretching or whatever and you can watch to this. Yeah. Biće korisno za kasnije rad. Uh, basically, about this plyometrics uh, training, uh, we, we should use it at their level very, very fruitfully. Dakle, plyometrics training možemo vrlo plodonosno primijeniti u njihovoj dobnoj kategoriji. But some of the exercises you will see they are uh, very good even at the senior level. Ali neki od zadataka koje za vježbe koje ćete vidjeti dobre su za primjenu i na razini seniora. I know that all of you being handball coaches loves theoretical presentation. Okay, znam da svi mrzite odnosno volite te teorijske prezentacije. Then I will try to be as short as possible. Biću kraći što je moguće. Because being handball coaches in the field, it's our duty. <laughs> then uh, we can start. Next. 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 Now. Um, there is the topics, the main points which you will uh, read about uh, during this presentation. General approaching. Dakle, mi ćemo pokušati definirati što je plimetrija, pokazati zašto je ona tako uspješna u poboljšanju uh, fitnessa i uspješnosti atletske, kako manipulirati uh, programskim variablama da bismo postigli taj uspjeh i something else. Um, as you can see, the plyometric terms has been interpreted during the time from many points of view, as it shows there. Dakle, tijekom vremena nekoliko je naziva koje se koriste za taj isti trening. Vidite plyometrics, klasična plyometrija i moderna plyometrija. Uh, basically, it's the same thing, but it's good to be known some, let's say, historical elements about the term. Dakle, bilo bi dobro da sada sad promotrimo neke povijesne činjenice o samome izrazu. So, uh, this is a general uh, definition of uh, the term, the first one, which was mentioned before. Dakle, ovo je, ovo je osnovno značenje, uh, pliometrije, vidite kako se piše sa uh, slovom i, ne sa slovom y. Uh, next, please. There is uh, an example of some exercises, we can, pre we can use it for that. To je jedan je primjer vježbe. Uh, here you can see some details about the beginning of this kind of training. Dakle, ovdje je početak zapravo pliometri kakvu danas znamo i to je početak u šok treningu. As you can see, it's a guy Fred Wilt who assumed that he developed this uh, way of training, but it's not true, you will see. Okay. As you can see, the shock method, how it was presented in the past, uh, belongs to Mr. Verhochansky. So those of you who uh, graduated uh, physical education study at least by my age, meaning 10 years ago, mm -hmm. then you should have uh, heard about Mr. Verhochansky because he was a part of our bibliography. Neki koji ste mojih godina i diplomirali ste na Gimeziološkom fakultetu ili Fakultetu za fizičku kulturu, sigurno ste upoznati s imenom Jurija Verhovšanskog jer je bio sastavni dio vaše stručne literature. Next, please. Again, here uh, there are presented some, uh, let's say, general principles. What does it mean, pleometrics? Basically, there are a, a succession 
of the muscular contraction uh, from the concentric point of view to eccentric point of view. Ovdje ću za sada će slijediti neke, neki principi koje ću vam prikazati, dakle radi se o mišićnim kontrakcijama, ekscentričnim i koncentričnim i koji, kako se one izvode i kojim redu slijedom. We will not go in the smallest details because in my opinion they are not so very important, but the main important thing is to understand how to work with this. Nije važno samo da, zna, da znate sad što je u, u cijeloj pozadini, ali morate znati kako primjenjivati dotične vježbe. Next, please. Sljedeći. Uh, most of the time the pneumatic training uh, has been uh, treated only from the lower limbs point of view, from the legs point of view. But uh, at the same time, this uh, training method could be used even for developing the explosive Uh, movements and force even at the upper limbs. Dakle, do nedavno gotovo su se te pliometrijske vježbe koristile uglavnom za donji dio tijela, dakle za noge i donji dio trupa, no u novije vrijeme koriste se i za eksplozivne pokrete gornjeg dijela tijela i ruku ramenog pojasa. If we will have enough time, maybe we will demonstrate something today. If not, then we will try to do it tomorrow. Ako budemo imali vremena danas, nešto ćemo pokazati. Ako ne budemo imali, onda ćemo to sutra napraviti. Next, please. Uh, what is very important to know when we start working with these guys in pleometrics? It is very important to take into account this change. Uh, ovo je zapravo sad najvažniji slajd uh, što, koji morate zapamtiti i morate znati kada budete uh, programirali pliometrijski trening, kada budete radili. Dakle, što, to što je redoslijed, što morate znati. Dakle, During our practical, uh, dakle mi moramo, što yeah, se we must crawl, yes. Yes. dakle moramo puzati prije no što hodamo i moramo hodati prije no što trčimo. It is very important because uh, we will start in pleometrics when we start to work with them especially uh, how we teach in athletics uh, we learn first to land not to jump. Dakle trebamo prvo naučiti kako uh, ispravno doskakati a ne kako ispravno skakati. Even if uh, the beginning we will use some easy exercises and well known by all of you then you will realize after some moments that they are very useful very useful as exercises even if they are simple počećemo sa nekim vrlo jednostavnim vježbama koje svi vi znate ali su jako bitni na početku za stvaranje baze uh, and now we will go as quickly we can through those four phases we are obliged to respect during our work dakle moramo poštovati četiri faze uh, progresivnog opterećivanja naših igrača. Uh, this is a very uh, important principle. The athletes, our handball players, first of all, must learn to absorb the shots and not uh, with the joints, with the muscle, but not with the joints. Dakle, u ovoj prvoj fazi akcent je na tome da naučimo naše sportaše kako doskakivati mekano. Dakle, kako će oni apsorbirati silu sraza sa podlogom, ne e, s globovima, nego mišićima. Because as you can see there, the first phase is very important because we, are, uh, we work on the stabilization of the joints, on the ankle, knees and hips especially. A to je osobitno važno za stabilizaciju zglobova, gležnja, koljena i kuka. Next, please. Uh, here uh, we have some drills examples, but uh, you will see that your imagination is uh, better than these images. Next, please. Vaša mašta je puno bogatija od ovih slika, a mi ćemo neke vježbe pokazati kasnije. Može dalje? Uh, so, during the first phase, uh, we are dealing with only single jumps and single hoops and you will see in the field but mm -hmm. during the second phase okay ovdje yeah. naskok Next. primjer naskoka druga faza then we can um, put in a chain yeah. okay dakle sad imamo više struku izvedbu istog istog motoričkog zadatka multiple jumping yes. so if at the beginning we are dealing only with one of this then we can make it one by one. 
vikend možemo povezati skokove ili ih možemo izvoditi jedan po jedan. Next, please. In the phase three, u trećoj fazi, we can introduce, we spoke, the sound to move, dakle, skok s pripremom, iz počučnja, pripremu za odraz. So it will be one of these, get the balance position and after that, again, get the balance position and, yeah, so it's a kind of example. Next, please. Again, as you can see, they jump from the upper surfaces on the ground, use this bounce and... Naskok, well. da, naskok na tklupu i onda saskok. Uh, here is a very good exercise, which uh, combine everything until now. Yeah, phase one, phase two, phase three. We will use it during the practical Ovo exercises. Ovo je zadatak koji kombinira zapravo sve ono što ste naučili u sve prethodne tri faze. And... Uh, The phase four basically is the last phase of our methodical approaching and uh, consists in multiple jumps and elastic responses. Um, meaning that we can use jumpings even with this kind of amortization. Yeah? Even if we are going a little bit much more than it's usual. Dakle, do sada smo skakali tako da smo radili uglavnom na amortizaciji sile, pa čak i kad se, kad se skakalo sa relativno više visine. Basically, all of this we presented until now, they have one big and very important goal. To spend on the ground as short time as possible. That means we develop the explosive force and... Ok. Yeah. Dakle, a sve što smo ovo do sada radili u ovom metodičkom postupku zapravo je priprema za onaj glavni cilj pliometrijskog treninga, a to je provesti što manje vremena na tlu prilikom doskoka i ponovnog odraza. Because we all know and our colleagues in before, the previous presentation, showed us a lot about the contemporary handball. It is much tough and the speed is the religion of the game in these days. Da, budući da je moderni, naravno, rukomet vrlo uh, zahtjeva snagu i oštarje, a uh, i zahtjeva eksplozivnu, eksplozivno kretanje, brzinu kretanja. To We je... don't have time to... No, Brzina vlada u rukometu, to je prošlost. 40 years ago, when Romania was virgin. <laughs> Now, as quickly as they can, they receive the ball and shoot. So we need to develop this. To so, develop this, we can use these pliometric programs. Dakle, mi moramo razviti takvu brzinu reakcije, brzinu pokreta. To potrebna nam je u suvremenom rukom, to, to ću vam pokazati kako. Uh, this is, let's say, a kind of introductory part to what we will uh, demonstrate tomorrow. Because tomorrow we will work a little bit in agility. And agility... It's a very good friend with pliometrics and proprioceptive training, but we will talk about tomorrow. Dakle, a ovo što ćemo danas raditi zapravo je uvoz za ono što ćemo sutra raditi. Sutra ćemo se baviti agilnošću i nešto proprioceptivnim treningom, jer zapravo pliometrijski trening i agilnost i proprioceptivni trening su vrlo usko povezani. General principle, if you are interested to approach this way of Uh, train our players is presented in this di diagram. Dakle, osnovni princip je prikazan u ovom di diagramu. Uh, dakle, u ekscentričnom pokretu nastojimo uh, smanjiti silinu, a u koncentričnom dijelu pokreta nastojimo produ uh, prod uh, na producirati silu, dakle, proizvesti silu, a to nam je sve potrebno za stabilizaciju tijela i za neuromuskularnu stabilizaciju. Basically, this is the heart of the entire training program. If we handle very well the core stabilization techniques, then uh, all the other compounds are very well developed and we can develop a lot of drills.
na koordinu. Dakle, ako ovdje uspijemo u toj stabilizaciji trupa, onda su svi drugi dijelovi, svi sastavnice će biti stabilizirane i moći ćemo razgranati naše stablo. Furthermore, uh, it will be uh, presented some uh, points. Uh, we will not go in the details because uh, all of you will have access to these materials and if you want to develop and if you want to uh, find much more details about this, you can contact me or my colleagues. Da, dakle, nećemo ulaziti puno u ovo. Radi se o dinamičnoj e, stabilizaciji e, zglobova. Ako vas više, nešto više zanima, možete se javiti profesoru, pa će on s vama komunicirati, a sve ćete dobiti prevedeno na vašim DVD-ovima. Uh, this dynamic joint stabilization is very important because we are dealing with uh, no, static balance and dynamic balance and uh, during the play they are using all kind of changing of direction but all the time the joints are very very stressed dakle a ta dinamična stabilizacija zglobova je nevjerojatno važna za sve ono kasnije što se radi zapravo u, u na terenu uh, jer imate stalne promjene smjera i to eksplozivne promjene smjera and that it uh, depends on multisensory condition as it presented there controlled instability and control instability it is uh, very well uh, let's say fulfilled by the proprioceptive training dakle ono što morate osigurati svojim uh, igračima je takvo okruženje trenažno koje će pojačati stimulaciju na njihove proprioceptore i mehanoceptore ali i kontroliranu uh, uvesti kontroliranu zapravo nestabilnost da, a to znači da oni još uvijek mogu uspladati nestabi, stanje nestabilnosti svojim aktivnosti uh, some kind of conclusions then uh, we have when we want to develop a program of pleometric design we must take in consider some of these details okay radi se naravno o o o dakle manipuliranju raznim variablama od kojih radimo program i da radi se o jednom multifaktorskom pristupu programiranju but what is very very important when we design our exercises and we want to build, let's say, construct a program which is taking into account pyometric principles, we must take in considering this succession. Meaning, first of all, we must use jumps, after that hoops, after that bounds, and after that box drills from the lower legs. Dakle, kada uh, radimo program vježbi i redoske kojima će se oni izvoditi, onda moramo ići od skokova, poskoka, dakle jednonožnih bounce, to je zapravo counter movement jump, to je vertikalni skok sa pripremom uh, i uh, radom na sanduku, odnosno klupici. And when we intend to develop this kind of program uh, for the upper limbs, then we must take into account that succession passes those throws in ballistic exercises. Dakle, a kada jačamo ili kada radimo na gornjem dijelu tijela, onda moramo poštovati sljedeći redoslijed dodavanja, suvanja, bacanja i balistički uh, balističke vježbe. Uh, ballistic exercises it refers to take the body from let's say a maximum extension position to a maximum flexion position. Dakle, balistički zadatak je ovdje ovaj primjer sa mas, iz maksimalnog zaklona eksplozivno se pretkloniti do uh, krajnje granice. And, and of course we can use it vice versa. I naravno obratno može iz dubokog pretklona eksplozivno e, zaklon i bacanje. Uh, this principle it's uh, the fundamentals, the milestone of uh, this kettlebell exercises which you saw now they are very trendy and they are very used in different ways and different sports. Pretpostavljam da su vama ovi neki principi zapravo poznati da ih koristite u svome radu. And uh, that is from the theoretical point of view. Thank you very much for your time. You can go home now. Hvala vam na pažnji, možete ići doma. Okay guys, stand up please. This is just the theory. Samo je teoretski dio naravno. Come here. Uh, please line up on the goal line. Postrojite se na goal liniju.
Okay then, so uh, taking into account that they uh, stay there uh, sometimes and they are not used with this because I saw them, they are very hard working guys. Kao što sam primijetio, to su vrlo, vrlo vrijedni momci. Uh, we will try to refresh their uh, mind and body and we will start using some funny exercises. First of all, please... First of all, please, easy running, way and back, please. Blagano easy running. Prema gore i pratite se. from this uh. okay so as I told you we will start have some fun until we will start hard working then uh, stretch your arms like this flex your fingers with the thumbs out okay Stretch again. Isprožite prste ponovno. And flex with the thumbs in. I zatvorite palac ša, uh, prstima. In, in, not uh, cover. In. In, dakle, okay. palac unutra. Then repeat Opopati. this movement. And uh, right to do this movement. Dakle, radite taj pokret, ponavljajte ga što brže možete. Yeah. Now try to do it as fast you can. Now, sada radite što brže možete. As fast you can. As fast you can. Još brže, još brže. Okay. Now you try to do that during easy running until the middle of the field and back. To isto radite dok yeah. trčkarate. And back, 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 until the middle of the field. Dobro, samo do polovice, možete se vratiti. The same, 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 same. Isto radite. Now we will try to do the same thing using some jumpings, meaning. Dakle, sad ćemo raditi uh, isto samo... But every two times we will do one movement. So it will be one, two, three, four, six, okay. seven... Uh, on the same, but every two times. Okay, so as you can see, it's a very simple exercise, but it's uh, referred to neuromuscular coordination, and uh, we are lucky because we are dealing with a very skillful guy, but you will see furthermore that it, it is a very a strong challenge to their potential. Dakle, okay. uh, ovaj zadatak je bio zapravo uh, za neuromuskularnu razvoj neuromuskularne koordinacije. Kao što vidim, radi se ovdje o vrlo vještim i do, uh, dobro treniranim uh, dečkima. Same okay. exercise, but running knees up. Dakle, podižite koljena, visoki skip, ne? Go boys! Quickly, quickly, quickly! Much quickly! Much quickly, brže, until brže, the middle brže. and back, and back, back. Quickly, quickly. Well done, well done. Odlično. Dobro. Tako je. Tako je. Bravo. Now, we will develop a little bit this structure. So, we will stretch again the fingers, please. Raširite prste. And when we flex, it will be one thumbs in, one out. A kada skupljate, sad ćete na izmjenično skupljati i palac će ići na izmjenično unutra vanu. And now we will repeat the same movement, but the other thumbs in and the other one out. Dakle, palac jedne ruke unutra, palac druge ruke ostaje vani, a skupljate ostale prste. It is previous exercise. <laughs> 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 
quickly, quickly. Try to do it as quickly no, as you can. Go. Try, try, try. Quickly, much quickly. Quickly, you can do quickly, that. quickly, 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 brze, 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 brze. Yeah. Hi there. Quickly, quickly, boys, quickly. Sad i treneri moraju to raditi isto. Nemojte samo gledati, isto vježbajte. Ok, try to do this by walking. Walking. By walking. Hodajte i radite isto. You are left handed. You are left handed. Ti si ljevak? No. The same back, same back. Natrag. Good. Tako je. Ok. Easy running, way and back. Lagano trškaranje. Do polovice, do kraja. Do polovice, ne znam. Okay, so we will start to do some serious things. A sad ćemo početi ozbiljno raditi. We will start running easily. Dakle, opet trčkarajte. No, just wait. Wait, 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 wait. On my every sign. Ostanite na liniji, na znak ćete početi trčkarati. You will execute us slightly jumping, but landing on the both legs, something like this. Dakle, lagani yeah. poskok i doskok na dvije noge, mekano... A semi-squat position, something da, like do this. Polučučnja. But we will work until the end of the field and the back. I do kraja igrališta i natrag. Go! Continue. Okay. Now, I will kindly ask you to look to the way of landing. Molim vas, pogledajte sada kako doskakuju igrači. You should notice some differences and we will go to discuss about it. Mi ćemo Now, tome raspraviti poslije. We will do the same thing, but I don't want to hear any noise in the landing moment. No, you should be as soft as lions. Dakle, radimo isto, ali ne želim čuti nikakav zvuk prilikom doskoka. Ne smije se čuti udarac nogu o tlo. Go. We still have an elephant here. Postoje li ste uočili razliku? Well done. Dobro. So, as we discuss on the theoretical approaching, the main important thing is to teach them how to absorb the shocks. And one of the most important methodical clue, let's say, it is this. Ask them to don't make any noise on the landing moment. Because if they are attentive to this, then they will be very attentive to be as soft they can during the landing moment. So that's why in the moment when they're doing like this, all of these are going to the joints and to the spine. And we all know that our handball players most of the time has back pain problems. Dakle, budete li svoje igrače uputili na to da se koncentriraju, da se ne čuje zvuk prijem doskoka, oni će to usvojiti i prestat će doskakivati bučno, jer naime sila se tada prilikom takvog neamortiziranog doskoka prenosi na zglobove i na kralježnicu. Znamo da mnogi naši igrači imaju problema sa leđima, sa kralježnicom. In the moment when they are preoccupied to make no noise, then they are doing in the right way exactly how they did in the way back. So they must roll the sole of the foot and the, the sport shoes exactly in this way. 
One more, please. Dakle, Wait kada rade go. tiho, kad nečujno, onda postavljaju stopalo ispravno, redoslijed od pete na, prema prstima. Ok. At the beginning, some of them try to land something like this. But it's not good at all, because we have a very small surfaces to land, and our balance is in danger. And then we can risk to make another, I don't know, injury in the ankle level especially. This kind of landing... Primijetili ste da su neki pokušali doskočiti na prste, što je loše zato što je podloga na koju se doskače vrlo mala i nestabilna, što onda može dovesti do ozljede gležnja. This kind of landing, using the toes, it is available only when we are dealing with side jumps or back ones. Dakle, dosok na prste dopušten je uvjetno rečeno samo kada radimo skokove u stranu ili unadrog. Same exercise back. Dakle, isti zadatak natrag. Well done, boys. Go. Dobro. Easy running, way and back. Easy. Trčkarajte tamo i natrag. And now we will go in the smallest details to develop these techniques of landing and some of the exercises which could and should be used during the training sessions, especially in prevention. Because all of us know the ACL injuries, anterior cruciate ligament injuries are very often in our discipline. Dakle, treba dosta raditi na ovoj tehnici doskoka, jer ona je, kada se savlada, dobar način da se preveniraju ozljede prednjega križnjeg ligamenta, koje znamo da su rukometu vrlo česte. Then, another easy exercise is during running at my sign. It will be a landing on one foot. A normal one. Yeah, in the same direction. Dakle, Please. Opet trčkarate i doskačete na jednu nogu. Go. 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 Okay. Dobro. Now, you should be very attentive on the next exercises to this detail. Now, run and jump from the right leg to the left one. Dakle, sad budite vrlo koncentrirani na sljedeću vježbu, doskačete na lijevu ili desnu nogu i s nje odmah se odražavate i doskačete na drugu nogu. Because it's normal, it's normally biomechanical, it's our habits. It's like we are... To je normalna biomehanička radnja. Now, I will ask you to perform the same landing on the, on the one foot, but jumping with will made from the left and left from the left. Yeah? Dakle, so, sada run. odražavate pre istom nogom na koju ste doskočili. Go. Left, left, right, right. But during running. Stop, 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 stop. Stanite. Try to make it as natural you can. We just Probajte train. to izvesti što prirodnije možete. Well, we just have him fun. You are too serious for this hour. Sad se igrate, nemojte biti preozbiljni. Running. Trčkarate. Running. 
Don't and after. Dakle, i, i, Just running. Iz, uh, right, right, left, 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 doesn't matter. I doskočite. Ne Go. morate se zaustavljati. Po... Aha. Aha. Vice versa. Left, left, right, right. Go. Yes. Go. Again. Opet. Come, come. Aha. Aha. Go. Normal. Good. What's your name? Kako ti je ime? Tomislav. Tomislav? Tomica. <laughs> okay. Not like this. Not like left, this. Left, left. Right, right. Yeah? Hi there, Tomica. Again. Ah, totally different. Potpuno drugačije. Good. Go. 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 Nah. Okay, easy running, way and back. Easy. Trčka rete. Good. Now, it will be the previous exercise, meaning jump from right, left from le uh, land from left, but the landing position, it will not be as before. It will be like this. Dakle, sad ćete isto doskakivati slično kao u prethodnoj vježbi, ali ne pravo crto, nego ćete zapravo postaviti stopalo pod kutom. What I ask you, Try to maintain the landing position at least two seconds. Dakle, pokušajte zadržati svoj položaj kada doskočite barem za dvije sekunde. Yeah, so, here, hop. Let's see, go. Pogledajmo kako će ići. Mhm, mm go. Go. Good, go. Um, pivot, uh, tell me your name, please. Uh, pivot, who is Pivot? Marco. Marco. Be attentive. I'm Be looking at you. Fuzzy. Again, please, the same exercise. Yes, Hendon. Mm -hmm. Go. Ah, keep the balance, keep the balance. Zadržite ravnotežu, probajte se zadržati u položaju. Please notice the following aspect. Some of them don't jump normally. They prepare their jumping meaning. Dakle, neki od igrača ne skaču prirodno iz koraka, nego pripremaju svoj skok na ovaj način kako je profesor pokazao. You, sh you should correct this movement. To moramo ispraviti. Because our exercise is transformed from a frontal jumping with a side landing in a side jumping. Dakle, jer će se na, naša vježba dalje razvijati iz ovog uh, linearnog kretanja sa, za, samo zapravo postavljanjem noge pod putom u uh, skokove u stranu. It will come this, it will come. Now, same exercise, Isto? but this time jump from left and land from left in side position. Yeah? So, hop, hop. Let's see. But do it by yourself with my sign, dakle, by yourself. Radite prema vrastitom ritmu, bez znaka.
Ostavite si prostora da imate dovoljno, da ne skočite nekom na nogu, jedno drugo. Keep the balance position, balance landing position. Držite ravnotežu. Normal, we are running, running, run, 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 run. No, normal, normal, here. Aha, the same back, the same back. Natrag isto. Tako je, bravo. Hajde, hajde. Hajde, hajde. Good. And now we will do the vice versa, meaning same feet, jump from left, from right, sorry, and land the same on right, but in this position. Dakle, sad se odražavamo s desnom, desnom nogom i doskakujemo na istu nogu, ali je sada stopala okrenuta prema van. Yes. Ah, it's totally different. Well done, boys, well done. Same exercise back. Same exercise. As you can see, we try to put it together different ways of landing. Because during the match, we deal with a lot of and an infinite ways of landing in different circumstances. Dakle, pokušavamo spojiti različite načine doskakivanja u različitim položajima stopala i smjerovima, jer to je prirodna situacija u utakmici koja se događa. Good. And now we will put it together. What does it mean? Sad ćemo to sve spojiti u jedno. Što to znači? You can jump one whatever you want, left or right. But after you land with exterior from the balance position here, perform the next one. Dakle, možete skakati sa lijevom desnom nogom, ali dakle, nakon što ste doskočili sa stopalom prema unutra, morate se s iste noge odraziti i doskočiti sa stopalom izbrnuti prema van. But it's obligatory. First external. Obavezno yeah. prvo and prema from unutra, this and iz tog položaja internal. u položaj stopala prema van. By yourself without my sign. Go. Dakle, svako su svom vlastitom ritmu. Aha, aha. Ostavite se prostora, dečki, malo se razrijedite. Na, it is the next exercise, this. Na, this is the next exercise. External, internal. Prvo van, pa onda... Da. Go, go. Good man. Well done. Hop. Hop. Dobro, dobro. Now, try to make the second jump not so short. Try to make it a little bit longer, at least half a meter. Dakle, probajte da vam drugi skok bude malo duži i barem pola metra. Go! As you can see, it's a very good coordination exercise. Because some of them have problems to respect the rule. Dakle, ovo je izvrsna koordinacijska vježba, odnosno za razvoj koordinacije, jer momci neki imaju problemu uopće da postoju pravilo vježbe. External, internal. Good. Higher. Higher, higher. Pokušajte da skok bude što viši. Ok, now you will perform until the middle. But I need as high and long you can to perform that jump from here to here. Dakle, sad ćete raditi samo do polovice igrališta, ali nastavite da taj skok bude što viši i što dulji. Don't rush, don't be in a hurry. I need a total control body balance. Don't do anything if you are not very well balanced. 
If you are unbalanced, don't do nothing. Lexi. Nemojte ni, držite dobru ravnotežu tijela, nemojte ništa raditi ako niste u dobrom ravnotežnom položaju. A little bit longer, a little bit longer, Marko. Aha, aha, well done. The same back, same back. Isto natrag. Higher, higher, higher. Yeah. Wing player. Krilo. Good. Easy running, way and back. Prečkarajte, tamo je natrag. All these kind of exercises put it together, meaning everything, it, it work on the uh, ankle and level with distortion movements that are very, very useful in prevention, in prophylaxy. Dakle, svi ovi zadaci zajedno zapravo su dobra profilaksa za prevencija za ozljede, zato što se rade na razini gležnja, ali i postoje kretanja u pokreti u trupu. One very important thing, you can ask to your players, even to the senior level, in the moment when they land, to make this kind of torsion, yeah, but you should ask them, try to do the same movement as me, yeah, but easy, 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 don't, don't try, control, control your body. Kontroliraj tijelo, lagano, dakle, možete pitati kad naprave ovaj pokret, što, da učine, da izvede torziju kukovima. This movement is correct, executed, when the soul stay all the time on the field, we don't need this. Again, please. Dakle, ispravna izvedba ovoga pokreta je ta stopalo mora biti priljubljeno uz podlogu cijelo vrijeme, ne smije se vagati, ne smije se odvajati od tla. Now, if you want to develop this skill, first of all, and to improve their joint stability, you should ask them, when you do this twisting, try to make like this with the toes. Dakle, pokušajte ih pitati, tražiti da izvedu, da čvrsto priljube malo prste uz podlogu. Osjećaš li nešto drugačije nego prije? Kako osjećaš u koljenu? Ovo je vrlo važan dio treninga. Um, it's good to be known. All these kind of exercises should be stretched at least, at least three months of working, at least. Da se ova vrsta zadataka, ova vrsta vježbi treba raditi najmanje tri mjeseca. Does any one of you is familiar with the triple jump structure from athletics. Da li poznajete strukturu troskoka iz atletike? It's okay, it's okay. Then we will perform the next exercise. To će biti sljedeći zadatak. And again we put together neuromuscle coordination, prevention and some principles from the biometrics using this exercise. Opet spajamo dakle prevenciju, dobru mišićnu kontrakciju i neke principe koje ste vidjeli ranije. So, during running, easy running, you should perform the following. Run, sign, left, left, right, both. Yeah? Again. Dakle, uh, Or right, je... right, left, both. It's up to you. It depends. By yourself. By yourself. Not so high. Not so high. Tomita, it will come. It will come. Nemojte previsoko sada se odražavati. Dobro. Tako je, bravo, bravo, boys, bravo. Try, please be attentive. The last jump should be in the same time, not... 
Dakle, pazite da vam ovaj dnoskog za dvije noge bude izveden oba stopala u isto vrijeme, a ne da postoji različit. Now to do the same thing, but a little bit faster. Sada malo brže, isto, ali malo brže. Aha, on the same line, on the same line. Dakle, držite svoj smjer kretanja, pravac kretanja. Good. Okay, now, during running, at my sign, you should do the same structure, but as short you can. That means... Yeah? Dakle, sada isto izvodite... Uh, as quickly you can, and in the short space. To kraće uh, pomacima prema naprijed. Go! Continue. At my sign, at my sign. Left, left, right, both. Go. <laughs> come on, boys, come on, boys. Good. Back, the same thing. Open. Come, come, come. Natrag isto. Quickly, quickly! Brže, brže, brže to. Go, go, go! Much faster, much faster! Još brže, još brže, probajte. Go! Quickly! Sad najbrže. Well done, well done, easy running, way and back. Well done! Opustite se, bravo, bravo. Go, running, running, way and back. Good. We will use the same structure, but this time we will perform it on the same place. Meaning, running in the same place. Yeah? Let's see. Go. Dakle, ista struktura, samo na isto na mjestu. Sve na mjestu treba izvesti. Aha. Aha. Good. Easy running back. Easy running back. Opet lagano trčkaranje. And now we will have a lot of fun. What does it mean? You will run, but at my sign. You will have left, 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 right, right, left, both. So we will put it together, all the exercises. We are not building nuclear rockets. We just have fun. Because in the field when you have to work with one-to-one, -one, no, none of the defender will respect what you want to respect. Because all the time it will be something new in your life. On the semicircle or on the nine meters, or in deep defense, three to one, which is your favorite. So, front, external, ex internal, right, right, left, two. Go! Bravo! Go! Go! You missed one step. Go! And now, you should do it by yourself, however you
Ant, but the same succession. Dakle, sad isto izvodite ovo, ovaj niz poskoka, ali kako god vi želite i kada želite. Bravo, bravo. Okay, um, a short break, one minute to have some water and uh, we will meet in the backs of that uh, hurdles. Uh, we, we can consider this uh, as a kind of warming up, let's say. But as I told you, uh, all these kind of drills could be developed and improved by you, but you should use it at least a long three months. Dakle, sve te vježbe možete raditi, ali ih valja uklopiti u svoj redoviti trenažni program najmanje tijekom tri mjeseca. Um, 15 minutes. Okay. I will need one more hour, but I know <laughs> it's weekend for you too. But anyway, we will handle it. Then we will make... Now we will try to, we will try to make these exercises uh, let's see, some kind of fun because all this physical working, we know all is not so pleased for them. And then, unijeti nešto malo zabave u ove vježbe jer znamo da fizički zadaci tjelesni fizička priprema nije baš zabavna za igrač. Okay, um, please split in to three in back of each. Dakle molim vas postavite se u tri kolone. Now, each of you, uh, please perform normal jumpings over this, yeah, one time each of you. And after that, continue with easy running and come back. Normal jumping, normal. And now we will start with the challenge stuff. The first three of you try to perform drift jumpings at the same time. You, you start whenever you want, not my sign. You are the first ones. Yes, the first one. So as you can see in the first drill, less of them were coordinated. Dakle, u prvom izvođenju nisu baš bili osobito koordinirani. Try to be attentive to some details and maybe we will discuss about after we finish this lesson. Uh, gledajte još malo detalje preskoka, pa ćemo o njima malo kasnije raspravljati.
the same thing, boys. Isto, ali ove nove prepornice su više. Please arrange that. Molim te postavi da, dobro. Na. Isto. Forward, side, side, dakle, unutra, and continue. Na stranu, pa opet naprijed. The same time. U isto vrijeme opet. Hi there, hi there. You notice that the complex the structure is, the much more coordinated they are. Primijetili ste da što je kompliciraniji zapravo zadatak, da su i oni međusobno koordinirani. And why is that? Zašto? At the beginning you saw it was too simple. Na početku je to bilo vrlo jednostavno preskakivanje telefonica. And some of them or most of them okay, three, two, one, go. And they were attentive to one to each other to coordinate themselves. I nisu bili osobito koncentrirani na ono što se događa, ajde gledali su samo što rade ovi drugi sa strane. Now I distract Sad sam odvojio. And after the first jump, they are very focused to do the best thing they can. Dakle, a i sada odmah kako su s pažnjem je skrenuta na ono izvode i nastoje izvesti to najbolje što znaju i mogu. And then they started to act somehow instinctively. I sada počinju zapravo djelovati instinktivno. Let's see what is happening now. One more for your satisfaction. Go. Još jedan put, molim. Yeah. 
Well done, boys. Well vrlo done. Dobro, vrlo Tako dobro. je. Bravo, bravo, bravo. And starting with now we will try to have some more fun. A sad ćemo pokušati još malo zabavnije raditi. And we will discover new abilities and skills of them. I pokušajmo otkriti u našim igračima nove sposobnosti i vještine. No, Tomica, no, only this one. No, bring the fence. Bring it to me. All of them. Sjedite me? No, no, bring it here, here, here. here. Donesi ovamo preporicu. All of the hurdles to bring it here, okay. Do you need the, all the, of them? Uh, no, it's like this. Okay. No. Dovoljno je ovo, sad što ste donijeli. Oh, higher one. Now split into two, in two teams. Razdvijajte se u dvije kolone, molim vas. In the same time. Počinjete u isto vrijeme. Go. Stanite. Ajmo. Okay. Dobro. So this was one of the execution. Tomica, please come here. Bilo je zadovoljavajuće. Dajte ovamo. Okrenite se. You will go at my sign. Yeah. A sad skačete u suprotnim smjerovima. Two, one, go. Wait, 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 wait. After Check go, you start. After go. Yeah? Three, two, one, go. 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 So you are again the first ones, yeah? Okay. Just prepare yourself. The other ones, come here. Just prepare. Come. Pripremite se. Okay. When they will start jumping, start with some noise.
Sada opet nastavljamo sljedeći. Sljedeći. Alex, switch on. Alex, switch on. Your mic, switch on. Three, two, one, go. Now we will perform the last one and you are free to do dakle, whatever you want. Dakle, zadnja vježba i onda ćete se moći odmoriti um, do sutra. Please bring all of those here. Stavite ove preponice paralelno sa ovim, ovom kolonom. No, like this. like this. Alex, what was the purpose of this clapping? Immediately. And, okay. Immediately. Objasniće nam uskoro koja je svrha bila ovog stvaranja ove buke. So Mitri, you'll start from there, you'll start from there. Uh, one cues so one starts from, here. from the opposite directions. You start by yourself. I will not give you any sign. Should they be coordinated as uh, before? Yes, you must be coordinated. But you will see something. You can start whenever you want. Cheater! Brže, brže. One more. Yes, you don't. Okay, uh, come here. Dođite ovamo. Line up. Line up. Uh, postrojite se. We will take a bow. Yes, uh, they are going, uh, poni će vam se sada. Okay. Three, two, one. <laughs> Hvala. <laughs> Hvala vam. Take you may, seat. you may sit, uh, sjedite, možete se odmoriti. Okay, it's normal. What was the meaning of, of all of these jumpings? Ja bih sad samo još nešto prokomentirao što smo radili. 
First of all, uh, we know that the team in handball must act like a family. Dakle, znamo da se u rukometu moramo ponašati kao obitelj koordinirano, povezano. But at the same time, like a gang of friends. Dakle, ali istodobno kao i ono špadra, prava špadra. And this gang of friends, in order to win a match or a championship or a tournament. Dakle, ne možemo osvojiti prvenstvo ligu ili turnir. Has to feel each other. Ako ne osjećamo jedni druge. Some of the exercises that we can use to test this kind of friendship. Dakle, ove ovi zadaci, ove vježbe su na neki način pokazatelji koliko su naši igrači međusobno povezani, koliko prijateljuju međusobno. Could be this kind of exercises because during the match, in the moment when must leave the ball to the pivot. We never, uh, of course, at the beginning when they are kids, okay, and I will do that and should go there. No, they will act instinctively. Dakle, oni će utakmice instinktivno reagirati. And they must feel each other. Otherwise, they cannot act like this gang of friends. Why? Because if I tell to the pivot as a center back, Take care of the second pass, I will do that. First, the opposite team will hear this. And all the time we will try to uh, be in time. We will try to work on timing, not to be efficient. Dakle, upozorite svoga, se, upozorite li svoga suigrača unaprijed što ćete učiniti, to nije dobro. Jer će to čuti i protivnik i onda će odmah reagirati uh, unaprijed i nastati to spriječiti. That's why at the beginning when they should perform only two simple jumps, most of them were unbalanced, let's say. Dakle, kad su izvodili one jednostavne skokove, bili su pomalo u neravnoteži, nisu bili koordinirani. That is receiving the pass and pass to the pivot. It is obvious. But in the moment when we uh, make the drills much more complex, Dakle, kad smo zadatke učinili kompleksnijima, receiving, crossing, pass to the pivot, then all of this must be felt. Mi smo prikrili zapravo svoje namjere i nenajavljeno smo izvodili određene akcije. And they confirmed that as complex the exercise was, much more coordinated they were. I oni su pokazali da što su složeniji zadaci bili, oni su bolje funkcionirali kao ekipa. Here, some of them were very well coordinated as long as they see each other. In the moment when they lost the eye contact, some of them become very unbalanced. Dakle, mnogi od igrača su bili dobro koordinirani dok su vidjeli jedan drugoga, ali kad su izgubili svog partnera iz vid okruga, onda su ispali iz te vremenske koordinacije. At the same time, some of them were very well coordinated until they, they lose the contact. After that, lost the balance, the frequency for one jump, but immediately, instinctively, they corrected. A neki su, premda su izgubili, dakle, taj simultanost, nakon prvog skoka uspjeli u drugom skoku opet uhvatiti ritam i spojiti se sa ritmom svoga partnera. And some of them, I think the first group, the first couple, Tomice and his league, they were coordinated during the entire execution. A prvi u koloni bili su koordinirani čitavo vrijeme izvođenja zadatka. This kind of behavior says a lot about their skills. Dakle, ta vrsta ponašanja jako puno govori o njihovoj vještini. And not at the last about their pleasure to play and their pleasure to be a part of the team i o njihovom zadovoljstvu zapravo da igraju i da podržavaju svoga partnera u igri. Which is the most important thing for us to build a team. A to je zapravo najvažnija stvar koju trener može učiniti za svoju ekipu. Then you can stand up please.
Možete ustati. Um, hvala to you and hvala to you. Hvala. Thank you, Mr. Alex. Hvala demonstratorima. Hvala i vama.